All right, boys, here we go. Um, I have been having so much fun with this. I hope this doesn't blow up in my face, but I I have been playing this new deck, and um, basically the whole idea is that it functions. My win condition, in theory, is Revel and Riches. Whenever a creature an opponent controls dies, create a colorless uh, treasure artifact token with tap, sac sacrifice this artifact, you know, what treasures do. Um, if you have 10 treasures at the beginning of your upkeep, you win the game. Okay? And so the reason I wanted to revisit this, and I had this for a while, and notice I have two blue wild cards on that stuff. Anyways, is because of her. Uh, Teza Karlov. And there's ways that I can improve this deck super. Like, I, I did not have the cards correct, like the right cards to do this deck, but like there's potential here. So her whole deal, and I'm sure this is news to nobody exactly, but I'm going to explain it anyways. Why the hell not? If a creature uh, dying causes a triggered ability of a permanent you control to trigger, that ability triggers an additional time. Okay. So that combined with Revel and Riches, like a single one means something that they own dies, uh, you get one treasure. If you have two Revel and Riches, you get two treasures. If you have two tre two Revel and Riches and a Tez, whatever the fuck name is, um, you get four treasures per creature killed, right? So in, in essence, at that point, all you need to do is kill three creatures and you win. Um, if you notice, there's a lot of stuff that is there to just keep us alive because the early game on this one is super rough. But the games are fun. This is definitely not a competitive deck in the slightest. This is jank. This is jank as jank can get. Um, I put three Revitalize, four Seal Away. These are bad cards. One Bankrupt in Blood just because. It's a really bad card. Really doesn't fit in here. I, I really am just trying to throw together random stuff. Um, Cast down Orzhov Enforcer, Gleam Barrier. Gleam Barrier, surprisingly, is pretty rewarding. Again, it dies. You create a treasure. If you have the other lady out, you make two treasures. Not bad. Um, um, let's see. Treasure map is huge. I need to get more of these. I have the rare wild cards to do it, and I might add to this as I go. Um, but for now, I'm, I've been working with a single one. Um, yeah, actually, I, part of this video is going to be me like messing with this because it's still not done. I have yet to draw her. Um, yeah, um, so most of this should make sense. Um, Slaughter the Strong has been touchy lately. I'm not sure if I'm going to keep it in there. But I put like every board wipe that I have in this thing. Um, Smothering Tithe um, is really good. So I, I, it took me a second to realize, but this works. This works with, um, this works with Revel and Riches. Uh, the treasures that you generate here count. So if they don't pay, I had a game, I've had so many cool games with this, like a lot of loses, losses definitely, but it's so funny when it works. Um, but the last card I played against um, a control deck and he kept drawing cards and it kept triggering this and he actually like gave me the game because he didn't realize that the treasures this creates satisfy the win condition for this. Um, so he like gave me 10 treasures on his turn. <laughs> Um, Pitiless Plunder, obviously. Um, I don't have a, I'm, I'm trying to figure out the balance here, okay? So whenever something dies, it creates a treasure artifact. I have two of these guys. Um, and so with her, or her, every time something dies, you get, um, two treasures per thing that dies on your side, too. Which is why I went with a lot of board wipe. Um, the one thing that Slaughter the Strong does is it allows me to kill a lot of my own creatures and select which ones, especially since I have a lot of weenies. Um, yeah. Uh, Seraph of Scales is just a generally good card. It was a very lucky draw I got from Pax when I was doing this. Alenda pairs so stupid well with her. I, if I had another, I would so do that. Every time something dies, put a plus one, plus one counter on her. When she dies, create um, that many uh, vampire tokens with lifelink, right? Really good. Bunch of Clones of Novas. Duh. Haunt of High Towers, just because it's a good card, and I just needed to throw good cards in here. Um, really, this is such a bad deck. It's such a work in progress. It's such random jank. A lot of the cards that I, I would like, I, I actually don't have access to, and it's weird stuff that I actually don't have any common wild cards for. So, like, uh, for example, one card I wish I could throw in here is a lot more of this guy, funny enough. When it dies, create a colorless treasure artifact. It's similar to the... Um, what is it? The Gleaming Barriers? Um, you know, it's, wor it's a worse defender, but it has a similar thing. Um, the only reason I'd want this as opposed to that is because there's a lot of synergies with pirates, and it would open my deck up to incorporating more pirate-themed stuff, so it would have an actual theme. Um, I don't want to attack with anything that's unblockable. Otherwise, Prying Blade might be a decent idea. Um, and again, like if I had the, I have the wild cards, I'm not sure if I want to spend them. Um, but I would definitely put in a lot more treasure maps. There's probably a whole bunch of other stuff that I have. I had Ruthless Knave and um, 
I'm probably going to mess with putting him back in or not. Again, like, you're going to watch me kind of develop this jank as we go. I've had such fun games so far, but, like, it's definitely got room for improvement. Um, instead of seal aways, cast downs would probably be better. In fact, let me do that right now really fast. Um, but, yeah, no, I was talking with a friend about Magic the Gathering earlier, and the idea for this deck came up. Oh, I already have two cast downs. Maybe... Sacrifice an artifact or a creature. Maybe I'll put these in. Deck um, draw has been an issue for me, actually. And then Dead Man's Chest is awesome. Draw, draw has been an issue for me, so let me put that in instead. Um, we're just going to test this jank out. But I think there's I, I think there's promise here for, like, um, an overarching theme. Maybe not, like, a definitely not, like, a winning deck as far as, like, oh, this is competitive and ladder. Like, because, you know, we get slaughtered by red. Um, but... It's a fun deck. It's a fun. It's a silly deck. It's just been really rewarding. This, funny enough, is an okay hand. Just because um, this will keep us alive long enough to get everything out. Hopefully, um, it's hard to tell in this meta. Um, yikes. Um, but early game, it's just it's just buy time, buy time, buy time, buy time, buy time, buy all the time in the world, right? Okay, that's that's enough lands. Thank you, wizards. Thank you, Wizards. I think I have enough lands. Thank you. Thank you. I literally got have of, of the top ten cards. Three of them are playable things. Awesome. Uh, I'm going to put the barrier out to block that one. Oh, I have another barrier. Hell yeah. I can't get enough of barriers. Um, they're awesome because they become money, actually. Underrated outside of the context of this game. Oh, this is not good. Oh, he's going to make a blocker. Or not a blocker, but a chump a block. And I can't destroy him because cast down doesn't work like that. Um, although I got my first cleansing Nova, which is awesome. Um, maybe I'll cast down this guy. I just need to slow him down in the early game. He has a lot of pressure and weenies and all that stuff. And I need to buy time so I can get everything up. This deck is definitely mid-range. Um, next turn, I'm going to get enough mana for cleansing Nova, which means I'll be in a pretty safe spot um, until... Late. What is this? Whenever a creature you control attacks alone, it gets plus X plus X, where X is the number of creatures you control. Ooh. Oh, that's problematic. All right. Well, maybe we'll be firing off the uh, Cleansing Nova a little early. Yikes. Mm, maybe not. Um, this would be hilarious. I'm actually going to settle him, just because it's funny. <laughs> um, oh, no. Wait. I got to... Ooh. Maybe I just destroy the enchantment. Whenever a creature you deck is... That's any creature, so I should be destroying his enchantment, I suppose. Ugh, that's kind of a rough call. Yeah, definitely destroy the enchantment. Yikes. Maybe destroy all creatures, though. I mean, if he doesn't have a lot of creatures, right? Resolve. Ouch. Um, Pass. Yeah, I'll lose my other guy. I'm going to lose him anyways. Okay, there's two treasures. Are you serious? Wizards of the Coast, are you freaking serious right now? We have to play this. Destroy all creatures. Goodbye. Okay, fresh board. Fresh board. I can play everything that comes up. So far, not so terrible. Just, we definitely need to do something about this. Um, yikes. What a weird card. Hey, it's her. Oh, no. Oh, no. That combination is... What are you talking about? Are you serious with this? Are you serious? Are you serious? I have gone through the top 15 cards. Well, okay, a few of them have been. Are you serious? I can't settle him. That's not good at all. That is definitely not good. That is definitely not good. I can destroy her? Maybe, yeah, it's a settle the wreckage time. Funny enough. Hello, yeah, well. I'm just going to keep resetting the board as long as I possibly can. That was probably a wasteful solo wreckage, but he's got three cards left. So, like, the threats aren't great there. Plus, I mean, I can definitely afford whatever comes out. I hate you, wizards. I hate you so much, wizards. I hate you so much. If he... Oh, I hate you so much. We survived. We survived so long. I've got literally nothing. Like, maybe, okay, maybe not literally nothing, but, like, come on. Blizzard. Or wizards. Deliver us to victory. Shit, and when she attacks, well, when she attacks, it won't really get that much plus anything. Oh, this is, okay, well, you know what, we're staying alive. And that's what matters. This guy has to be, like, frustrated, except for, like, he's about to get his, like, emblem. Oh, that's a terrible emblem. Oh, that's a terrible, well, unless I get the right cards, I don't know. Yikes. Look how far you've come. Okay. 
Hey, it's tapped. Check that out. What's up, bud? Hey. Uh, get out of here. We're staying alive. We haven't taken a single hit yet. <laughs> he hasn't gotten to use as anything. Um, yeah, definitely this. I am such a bad... Yeah, do it. I know it's a win condition, but please, for the love of shit. Oh my god, please. Like, something better than this guy. I Zero of my win conditions have come up, and there is definitely mana for it. Are you kidding me right now? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and then this will be land number eleven of the top twenty. Uh, I, oh, Wizards of the Coast, you're killing me! You're killing me! You're killing me! Look at this. I mean, it is a late game deck, but like, and we aren't close to dying, but that's not good. That's not good. At least it has summoning sickness. I got a turn. Maybe if I get, maybe. Uh, okay, good. Okay, good. 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 Oh, super good. Give me something good. Not that. Fantastic. Really what it is, I want chump blockers. Thank you. I will gladly trade. I need chump blockers. Thank you, bud. Okay. If there's one thing this deck is good at, it's surviving with nothing. I've, I've witnessed this, and because of how... Damn it. And because of... Damn it. Will not kill. No, every turn. And they can't... Okay, that's probably a good game. There's no way that I get this engine rolling. This is garbage! Oh my god. And you're gonna destroy that so I don't have a blocker, and then you're gonna actually use your one thing. We have been struggling over this. You haven't gotten in with single attack. That's a four. Okay, it's not terrible. Oh, but that... And that... And that... Oh... Oh, what a cool combo. What the fuck? I don't fucking... Ah! Okay, this was a terrible card. This is not staying in this deck. This doesn't work in this deck at all. This sucks. This is terrible. This is terrible. Strength is born of struggle. Uh, this is game. This is terrible. Are you kidding me with this? I have, I have like... I have so many lands. Are you kidding me? Yeah, yeah, you get three more cats. That's terrible. Are you kidding me? Pay two life. Good game. Good game. Okay, so, pro tip. When you draw... Jesus, the six... When you draw 12 lands in your first... I don't know how many turns. Okay. 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 That doesn't feel good. That doesn't feel good at, at all. Um, so screw this card. Okay, let's find something else. Let's find something else. Oh, that's terrible. What a horrible way to start this. Um, what goes well with this? Things die, I get treasure, right? Things die, I get treasure. I don't really have a lot of life gain, but I love Donna Hope and this guy's combo. Um, do I just throw in another revitalize? This is pretty awful. Maybe I should find something. Oh, Mortify. I don't have Mortify. That's holding me back a lot. Excess of Mortality. Um, I really don't want to spend my Uncommons on this. Especially since I could get the Immortal Sun. Maybe that's what I'll get because this handles Planeswalkers pretty well. Mm, I mean, it handles a lot of stuff pretty well. But then what's my... Um, what's my... Um, you know. Oh my god, words, why? At the beginning of your upkeep, you made... Uh, um, Sanguine? I end up with a lot of mana. That's a terrible card to throw in here. I don't know why I'm throwing that in here. I just have no idea what to throw in here. Um, maybe I should take some board wipes out and replace them. I wish I had Legion's Landing. Throw some more... I mean, like, really... Treasure map is where it's at. Do I spend a rare on that, though? <sighs> Decisions. Um, I'm not going to stay here too long. Forget it. We're done. We'll just give this a shot and see what happens. I'll think about what cards to put into it while something's going on. I really don't want to bore you guys to death. I'm so sorry. Okay. Um, the dog father. Okay. <laughs> this is a bad deck so far. Uh, let's do it. We have a lot of ways to stay alive early. We have a lot of ways to be annoying and buy time when we get like mana going for like the really big hitting stuff. Delay, 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 delay. 
Come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on. Come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Right. Do I revital? It depends what he does, I suppose. If he doesn't play it too. Oh, boy. Well, first off, I'm just going to do this one real fast. I'm going to prep this before we have anything else to do. Hey, nice. Nice. Okay, okay, okay. Something's coming together. I can see it. I can see it. Oh, boy. Um, nice. Uh, I'm going to put you out. You provide a lot of nuke targets. Go ahead, nuke her down. Have fun with it. Yeah, go for it. Hit me. Please waste your spells on her. Oh my gosh. This is actually pretty good. Okay. Um. Now, I could put her in and then cast down my own creature. That would be hilarious. I'd get four creatures. Nah. Next. Okay. Hang on to my hand. Hit him with everything I got. Um. Next. Are these instants? They're instants and turn. That's beautiful. Even if he gets a bunch of creatures up. <gasps> All right, well, so I told you guys that this is weak against uh, mono red. Uh, just, just prove that it actually destroys mono red. So there you go. What's the counter to mono red? How do we survive in this current meta? We go treasures. We go treasure hunting. So far, so good. We're one and one. And then not only are we one and one, but the first one doesn't even count because like, <laughs> How often do you get mana flooded in a deck like this? I should probably look at my lands. Um, but yeah, doing good so far. Doing good so far. Here we go. This dude's rink. Okay, okay. We we haven't yet got to do anything remotely close to what this deck is designed around. This is a terrible hand. Um, that is an interesting hand. A very interesting hand, actually, because I can we can play the Gleaming Barrier and then activate both costly plunders off of it which isn't a terrible opening it's definitely not the opening we want but it's i don't want to mulligan too much oh merfolk oh fantastic oh boy we get to figure out if this deck works against merfolk sweet yike many a yike were had today um please don't have anything that destroys yeah nice oh okay 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 actually we're gonna treasure map first get that rolling asap for sure and i actually like this card Card advantage, surviving, building up, getting ready to get rich. Gonna make it rain. Gonna pull in all of the money. Um, do, 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 do. Come on, come on, come on. Beautiful ADD shine. Ooh, yeah. First, let's scry. Done. Definitely need another land. And revitalize. And then play said land. Aren't doing so bad. Aren't doing so, so bad. Okay. I do need blockers. So I, my original plan to sack the Gleaming Barrier um, is no go. Although maybe when I flip treasure map, we'll do everything. We'll flip treasure map, sacrifice all three treasures, and do costly plunder both times. That's what? one. That's five cards drawn. That's not bad. Especially with this garbage going on. Oh, especially with this garbage going on. Okay, so first off, we're going to... Scry. Um, I'm guaranteed at least one land, but I got mo mono flooded the other day. So I have a feeling in the process of doing this move, I'm going to get all of the lands I need. Don't do. Oh, and then of course, and then I, I need this. Again, I still need to slow him down a bit. I should have waited on that one, but like, it's whatever. Um, and then next. Next. I'm not going to end turn. I'm gonna take like five here, so I'll be down to 14. That's not great um, But you know, it's not really about health, right? It's really it's really about money. It's about making that dough Okay Yikes, okay many a yike Ooh, Yikes on bikes. Why would you play that there? That is like the worst place to play it my turn That is the worst. Okay, so two things I can do this I can do this. Okay. Oh, snap. And then I can do... Um, actually, if I costly plunder one of my own... Okay, so I'm going to do... This. And I can cost the plunder next. I don't want to cost the plunder. And turn. 
I can also block and then cost the plunder the thing I'm blocking that I know is going to die. I wonder if he has another Tempest Caller, and that's why I was so reckless with the first one. Um, yikes. So that Sanguine Sacrament that I threw in my deck, it'd be great right now. It'd be super great right now. Oh, shit. Is that game? Two, three, um, four, six. It's not game. I'm going to wait. Next turn. Next turn, I'm going to start. Ne things are just going to start getting better. Yeah, you're going to. How many Tempest Callers do you have? How many Tempest Callers can I survive? Pass. Fuck. My turn. Oh, I get a turn. That's good. Yikes. <laughs> what's up, dude? Ah, uh, what's up? <laughs> oh, snap. All right. We're still in this. We're still in this. Okay. Oh, boy. And then I can get ta Taza right out, right? So he's only gonna have four. Oh, dude, we're in. We're in. We're good. Nothing's unblockable. Nothing's unblockable, and I have a whole bunch of stuff that can block. And then I get Tessa out, or yeah, Tessa, Tessa, Tessa. I get Tessa out, and then I sack a Gleaming Barrier with Costly Plunder. That'll generate two treasures, and then I can sack one with Treasure Trove to draw another card. So that's a three. That's three draws. Four with my normal draw next turn. Yes. Yes. Nice indeed, my friend. Um. Yeah, we're gonna do this. I'm an idiot. Uh, undo. Uh, thank you for letting me undo. Uh, no attacks. I definitely want the threat of a death touch there. Again, we still haven't drawn our win condition, which is like a huge part of this deck. If we had Revel and Riches, we may very well have won the game just then. Like, or have gotten super close. Close enough that like, gleam, yeah. Okay, thanks for the land. Um, so, the plan is Sack a Gleaming Barrier, which will generate two, yeah, two treasures. And I draw two cards. Ba boom, ba boom. I have settled the wreckage now, and I can sack a treasure. Submit. Bada boom. Okay, I have another isolated chapel, and then I have you. Afterlife two. Okay, ba boom. No attacks. Okay, I'm threatening a big block. Although, if he has, like, a third Tempest Caller or, like, a fourth Tempest Caller, like, if he just has all of the Tempest Caller in the world, I really should keep this up. I really shouldn't go below four mana in this game at all. Yeah. Okay. And I can block. Is he going to try to go around me? He can't. Not quite yet. Um, so, an Isolated Chapel. Uh, draw a card. Submit. There it is. That's fantastic. I just risked myself losing the game, but that's fine. Um, yikes. On bikes. Nice. No attacks. Yikes. Um, this is scary. This is scary. This is scary. <gasps> oh, <Whew. Holy> shit. <laughs> Oh, should I do it? Should I do it? Yes, I should do it. That's it! <laughs> <laughs> Woo! Yes! 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 Fuck yes! Good game! <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Holy shit. Oh my god. Next. Next. And turn. Even if he has something with haste, I have set all the wreckage available and I still get my win condition. Good game, my dude. Resolve. Oh no. Oh no. Please attack with something. I want to show you that it was like over. Oh my god. Good game. Hell fucking yes. My turn. Yeah, what? Oh. <laughs> oh, there you go. <laughs> and there it is in action, boys and girls. Oh, I love this deck right now. And this is the garbage version. This is terrible. This is a terrible version of this. Like you saw, there's so much bad in there. Like it can be optimized. Anyways, I hope you watched. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed watching my video. Um, 
yeah i think the normal stuff that youtubers say right now i right? like and subscribe and all that stuff i want to get more into this i want to show you guys all the janky crap that i put together <laughs> and if you enjoyed this i have so many other decks and so many other ideas brewing um so yeah um enjoy see you later bye